Hello and welcome to the preview of Day 7 of the Tokyo 2020 Summer Olympic Games. Day 7 will see 27 sports in action with a total of 21 gold medals for grabs. Yesterday, China overtook Japan at the top of the medal table with a total of 15 gold medals, which is also the same as Japan. However, China have won more silver medals than Japan. Yesterday was the worst day in terms of positive COVID cases related to the Games with a total of 24 positive cases, including three athletes. Today is finals day in the women's individual event in archery with number one seed An Sun from Korea Republic aiming to make it three golds from three events at Tokyo 2020. The final will be at 4.45 p.m. Tokyo local time. The competition begins today in athletics with the women's 100 meters preliminary round at 9 a.m. In the evening session we have the heats in the 4x400 meters mixed relay and this will be the first event added to the athletics program since Beijing 2008. The last event of the session will be the men's 10,000 meters final. Joshua Cheptege from Uganda will definitely be the favorites to win the first medal on offer in athletics at these games. In 2020, he broke the world record for this event, which had not been broken for 15 years. The first badminton medal will be decided in the mixed doubles and it will be an all Chinese affair. After upsetting Australia, Belgium will be looking to book their place in the next round with a win against Puerto Rico. The United States can also book their place today with a win against Japan. Germany and Australia will be looking to finish on top of the medal tally in canoe slalom on the last day of action in this sport. Athletes from these two countries have qualified in first and second place respectively for the semi-final. The quarterfinals in the women's football tournament sees Eight of the top 11 teams from the world rankings in action and expect to see four very competitive matches today. The first match kicks off at 5pm with the following matches starting one hour apart. The bottom place teams in both groups in the men's handball meet today with the losers effectively being knocked out of the competition. Final day of group play in the men's hockey and there are quite a few teams who will be wanting to get a win today to avoid Australia and Belgium in the quarterfinals. Japan will be aiming to make it 6 out of 7 gold in the men's judo events on the last day of the individual events before we head into the team's event tomorrow. It is the last day of competition in rowing. We start the day with some classification races for the single skulls events before moving on to the medal races in the single skulls and eights events. In women's rugby sevens, we will see the final round of group matches in the morning and quarterfinals in the evening. There are four medals up for grabs in swimming today and in the women's 100 meters freestyle it will be interesting to see if Emma McKinnon can back up her Olympic record from the heats with a gold today. China will be looking to continue their domination in table tennis as we have an all Chinese final for the second day in a row. In tennis it will be an all Croatian final in the men's doubles. There will be two top of the table clashes in women's water polo when the United States take on ROC and Spain take on Australia. 
Hope you enjoy the action of day 7 at Tokyo 2020 and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to be notified when we publish our preview of day 8 where we will see the first ever medal winners in three brand new events.